He's got 10 points from 12, Mike Jackson, and his team. It's not bad, is it? That's, that's an unbelievable response. It, it, is, it is amazing having... I, I was thinking, what have you got rid of Daichi for? You know, he's, he's been mate and he's doing a great job. And I think to myself, you've made a massive mistake when he goes in. And, and, and the way they're playing, I don't think it's a massive difference. They look a little bit freer on the ball. That's exactly it. It's a little bit more freer on the ball, not so regimented. Look a little bit better going forward, creating loads of chances. And um, at this stage of the season, where they are, absolutely perfect timing. Burnley have got some good footballers. Let's get it right. They've got some good footballers. And you're now starting to see that. Now he's coming. Yeah, it's, it's easier for someone like Mac Jackson to come in because if the results went the other way, the relegation's yeah. not on his watch. Yeah. So what he's done, and it's very, very simple... And there's a couple of little technical changes. What he's done basically is he reminded Dwight McNeil of how good Dwight McNeil is. Mm. And he's reminded Charlie Taylor. And yeah. he's reminded Jay Rodriguez. Mm. And he's reminded Veghorst, even though he took him off in the game. He's reminded other players in that team how good they are. He's put a smile in the face. I'm watching Dwight McNeil. I can remember sitting here four or five years ago when, when uh, Man City sold Leroy Sane. And I was thinking, he'd be a gr- br- brilliant replacement. Yeah. So the results that they've had, I heard a stat the other day, and I'm not really... The stats man, but Mike Jackson's took more points for Burnley than the previous three Watford managers. And we should point out that's this season. <laughs> that's this season. That's this season. That's three incredible. <laughs> incredible. Yeah. Yeah. So the job that he's done, he's relaxed the players, he's told them, go out, enjoy yourself, express yourself, and you can totally see it in their performances.